Hey guys, welcome back to our Discord JS tutorial. So in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make a premium system. So this command has been, I mean, this system has been requested tons and tons of time in my Discord server. So if you would like to give a suggestion for your next video, feel free to join the Discord server. Links will be in the description. Okay, so before we start, um, I would just like to remind you that you need MongoDB to make this command or this system. So if you don't have MongoDB set up, you should see a card pop out on the right top right of your screen just click on that and um, just set mongodb up without further ado let's get right into it all right so for the first part um just create well let me just close okay just just create a model so i'm just going to name this premium js okay cons uh model i'm going to cons m because we require mongoose module the exports equals to m dot model premium and then i can do something like m a new m dot schema okay so we're gonna just save the users uh we're just gonna save the author's id so we're just gonna do this so just m dot model new schema just user just user, nothing else. All right, so that is all for the schema. So let me just keep that intact. Um, next we're gonna move on to commands. Okay, let me just create a new folder. Okay, so we can uh, actually nav uh, navigate our uh commands easily, so we can find where our command is. So let me just do um add premium. So this command is basically uh, adding a premium membership to a user. So we can first we need to uh, get the premium schema. So it's going to do const premium schema because require another slash another slash models slash premium. All right. Next, I'm um, just going to use this DGS code snippet. All right. So this is premium. Okay, so make sure just to uh, quickly grab your own, I mean, your author's ID. Just get your ID real quick. So just, um, okay, just get that ID. So first you want to check if you are the one who is running this command. So you can just do if uh, message the author the ID. It's not equals to this. Just gonna do return. All right. So next, uh, we're gonna do we're gonna define users. So cons user equal message dot mentions the users the first or message dot guild. I just gonna just use member, so it's gonna be the same. Let me just change this to member. Member. Members the first and a message dot guild members the catch that get members the catch that get um r is zero all right so in here uh, after that we're gonna check if there is no member return message to reply please specify a valid member okay so once it's specified we're gonna go to search uh we're gonna search in our database by doing premium schema no find one okay i'm gonna find for user which is message which is um user uh, member the id okay next we're gonna do async error data if error if there is no data let's just do if uh if there's data return message to reply this user has already gained premium features so this is if um the person already has uh the date uh this data is already in the database so we're just going to reply if this user already gained the premium feature so next if the data doesn't exist we're going to create a new data by doing new premium schema and then uh, we can just pass in user will be use uh, member id 
Okay, and then make sure to add a dot save after the new. And then yeah, you can just do return message dot reply. Um, you can do something like added. Um, uh, added an user to the database. Okay, so this is the basic setup for add premium. Uh, let me just change this to add. All right. So for the next one, we're going to do the same thing, but for remove premium. So do something like remove. Let me just do del premium. Basically delete premium, but it's just like in a abbreviation form. All right. So um, just copy and paste this in here. We're going to change a little uh, some stuff. Del and then um, we can do. Let me see. All right, so this is all correct. Okay, next in here. Okay, so let me just remove all of these. All right, so after premium feature, uh, we're gonna find for a database if there is no data. So if there is no data, return message to reply. Uh, we can just say user was previously not added to the database or something like that. You can write whatever you want. Okay, and then if there's data, we're gonna delete the data by doing data.delete. And then we can do message.channel, send, uh, delete, uh, removed user from database. That's all. All right, so next we're gonna move on to the message event. So we're gonna handle the, um, we're gonna check if the command is a premium command. So let me just search my message.js, perfect. So, uh, same thing, we're gonna require the schema. So const um, premium schema equals require the slash, I think it's lower slash, models slash premium, is it? Let me just check the folder structure. Um, yep, it's, Slash. Okay, so we can move on. Uh, let me just find. All right, so in let me just do it after the blacklist. Okay, so after the blacklist, and then we're just going to do if command dot premium and and then we just do a exclamation mark bracket await a uh, premium schema dot find one and then we need a bracket and then we need to find the message to alter the ID message to alter the ID all right so if it's not a if it's a premium command and the person is not a premium member we can just do return message to reply um let me just space it down so you guys can see it return message to reply and then we can just write something like um you need pre to upgrade to premium to use this command all right okay so let me just teach you guys how to add a command as a premium command so simply let me just go to my ping command because that's a uh that's the easiest command um i'm pretty sure it's in info yep it's a ping ping.js so in here if you want to make a command premium simply just do in here just do premium and then just make it true okay if you don't want it to be premium simply just remove this all right so let's just test this out all right so let's just start the bot up no dot all right so now the bot is online let's just test out the ping command so if i do ping command right now it should work because there is no premium feature right so let me just change this to premium let me just show you premium if i make it a true all right and let me restart the bot all right and then if i run y ping again and just say um you need to upgrade premium to use this command so um, I'm just going to pull up my Discord account. Let me just add 
my Owl account as a premium member. So you can do this by doing add premium and I will ping my Owl account. All right. So there are any errors? User is not defined. Oh, I forgot. This isn't user. This should be member. Member, but it should uh, add the member to the database already. So it doesn't really matter. Yeah. All right. So um, I should be able to use the Y ping command right now. Okay, as you can see here, uh, it actually works. So let me just say uh, I want to remove. I can remove the premium membership by doing Y Dell premium. And then when the ping programmer is live, removed user from database. So if I run Y ping again, it wouldn't work because you need to upgrade to premium to use this command. So yeah, that should conclude today's video on the premium system. If you want to watch more Discord JS tutorials, stay tuned under the end to see a playlist that you can click on. Other than that, have a nice day. See you again next video. Bye.